Hi members, I uh, hope you're all going well at this time and the usual time of the world at the moment. Um, we're just out here on the 16th hole um, with a bit of feedback from members on, on uh, latest correspondence and while I've been marshalling, uh, there's a few divots out here that aren't being repaired and some pitch marks as well. So we're going to take you through uh, some options at the moment while there's no sand buckets. The reason we don't have our sand buckets available is just due to sharing and sanitisation. Um, we thought it was safer to keep them away at the moment. Um, for those of you that do have a sand bucket that you own, um, by all means keep using that. But we thought we'd give another option, just show you how to tap in a divot. It can tidy up any mess on the fairway and allow that grass to grow back in, in a reasonable time and uh, minimise the scarring on the fairways. So uh, right here, just so happens when we come out, there was a divot just waiting for us. and. Uh, the best way to deal with these when you see them or if it's your own divot is uh, just to grab your club and what we're going to try and do is just try and tap in the edges of this divot here you can try not to disrupt the root system too much go around that divot as much as you can okay once you feel like it's a pretty good job there just using your foot and tapping them down so hopefully you're using better footwear than i am at the moment to be playing golf but uh, you know, at the end product is uh, pretty nice and clean and the, hopefully the grass will grow back in no time. So without a sand bucket, we recommend just tidy the divot up like that. That would be great. Uh, we'll see you at the green shortly to do a uh, pitch mark.